Hello and welcome to another edition of Beer Dad's Beer Reviews. Going to do another vocation beer. Otherwise I wouldn't have it emblazoned across my my manthropnies. Um, we're going to do one of their new stout releases. I'm going to do this one. And this is Knockout. This is a classic stout coming in at 6.6% ABV. Have a look at that. We've got two boxes there with gold shorts and gold gloves on. Now, two years ago, they did this beer. Um, and it was an export stout. And it's if you want to have a check it out, check out the uh, vocation playlist. And it's beer number... Beer number 2156. This was available in Tesco at the time. Not now, obviously, because Tesco have moved on. I say it's a classic stout. It says rich, dark, and smooth. Um, again, on the back, it's pretty much exactly the same as what it was with the previous incarnation two years ago. It's a no-nonsense, straight-up export stout that packs a punch. Both flavours of coffee and dark chocolate with a subtle hint of coconut, rich and rich and roasted with a lingering bitterness. It says it's smooth, it's rich and it's dark and it's hopped with talus. The original one, I say two years ago, was hopped with sabra. Two years before that, so four years ago, they did I did a version of this called Tough Nut, and it was a brown ale, and it was really good. They released it over like a, a Christmas box, I think. They got like a twelve, a twelve box, or a six box of new one-off beers, and that was one of them. And that spawned knockout, and then spawned this this version as well. Um, I have had this before. I've got, I'm gonna I'm gonna say, um, for all for clarity, I um, because I don't know when you'll see this. Because I'm recording this on the thirteenth of September, so you're probably gonna see this probably the first week of October, round about then. Um, yeah, anyway, so let's pop a top on this, see what we've got. There's a little bit of gun smoke off the top of that. Can we taste the glass? So let's pour her in. So, this pours a, I think it pours a relatively clear brown beer. And again, this is what happened when I, I had it earlier on. I just a massive amount of head in my. Uh, in the tasting glass. Anyway, so beer glass, what have we got? One, two, two, well, two fingers, density compact, beige head, dark, that guy, excuse me. Yeah, tanned, tanned head. A beer itself, it had to jet black beer. It really is, it's, it's, it's lovely. Lovely. So let's go for the body, eh, body. let's go for the aroma. Cheers. It smells like a classic stout. Put this light on. A little bit, is that a little better? Is that not better? I don't know. Anyway, um, it smells like a classic stout. It smells roasty malt. It smells dark chocolate. It smells coffee. It does. It smells really cool. If I switch this light off, there we go. That's better. It smells. It smells good. Let's go to the budget combination. Cheers, everybody. Well, this little bunch is quite light. Um, it's quite light. Carbonation is nice and soft. It's okay. I would like a bit more body to it. I would like a bit more. I know it's called knockout, but a little bit more punch to it. I am. Um, but it's, it, it's okay on on first go. It's all right. So I'm going to wrestle it into a glass. We go for a big taste. Right. So let's go for it. Big taste. Cheers. That's, that's really nice, apart from the body. It's just, the body's so light. But it does, it does pack a punch. Again, pardon the expression, it packs a punch. 
It is bitter. It is coffee. There is dark chocolate in there. It does taste like an export stout. There's no getting away from that. But it's really light in the body. I just like it to be a little bit thicker and a little bit heavier. Other than that, there's nothing wrong with this. It's really tasty. This is the type of beer you could... I'm just going to lean for a minute. This type of beer you could drink... Excuse me. A lot of these, and you wouldn't realise it's a 6.6% ABV beer. You really wouldn't. Because that body belies the ABV. I think it's really nice. Really, I think it's really nice. Is it the best beer that they've done? No. Is it the best beer? Is it the best stout they've done? No. But it's still... I, I, I'd happily drink a few of these. Two... Three of these. Watching the match, watching the cricket, watching the Grand Prix. Yeah, it's it, it's okay. Is what it is. It's okay. So, it's a fly in here. Freaking out. So, like I say, it's too easy to drink. So this is. This is Vocations Knockout Classic Stout. It's the second version of this beer. The first one we did two years ago. It's it's review number 2156. Check that out and compare it to this. I um, Do I like this beer? Yes. Would I buy this beer again? Yes. Would I recommend this beer to friends? Yes. I think it's really nice. Um, if you've had this, let me know what you think. Put a little comment in. The last one got into Tesco as I say um, I don't think this will because I don't think the first one lasted long enough um, anyway so if you like the video put the thumbs up if you like the video put the thumbs down subscribe down there somewhere and I will see you on the next one so there stay safe remember life's too short to drink shit beer and I drink this so you don't have to here you go.